Mrs. Johnson. Uh -huh. You know they say travel expands the mind? Well, let me tell you, it expands other things too. Donovan, I don't have time. I have to arrange the church summer outing before service this evening. Forget the church. Let me uplift you. I'll take you somewhere. You won't need no guidebook. You won't need no street map. You won't need no satellite navigation. Because my compass always points north. Let me put it over the way. I, as a pilot, with years of experience, come into my cockpit, admire my flight deck, play with my flaps, but go easy with my Honda carriage. And then lie back in business class and let me slowly engage my reverse thrust. Look, Donovan, I'm meeting my sister Esther any minute, and I don't think she will Come appreciate. On. Let's set sail for the land of total satisfaction. Marvel at my hunker. Hoist my main sail. And if you don't behave yourself, you'll have to walk my plank. Oh, over here, Esther. I will lead you into new worlds. I is Sir Walter Raleigh. You is my golden hind. I is Alexander Fleming. You is that bacteria he left overnight in the laboratory. <laughs> Who is this man, Root? Donovan, this is my sister, Esther. Don't worry, you know. I can fit two potatoes on my plate. There's <laughs> Jamie Holliver. Who is my two fat ladies? Is... <laughs> it wasn't much of a trip, but what a fantastic view. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>